I, I, uh, <laughs> sorry guys, I, I went to the bathroom in this round one and I missed the Guile. Alright, I'm back though, and Guile put the Jamie in burnout and is hitting the lick right now. He's a semi-final, let's see Sion get his Guile run back. Ooh, now they're both burnt out. I don't know what Jamie's chip situation is like though on two drinks. I know what it's like on four drinks, I don't know what it's like on two drinks. For anyone who doesn't know a lot about Street Fighter, Jamie gets wasted after doing certain strings and four drinks. He lets his he lets his hair down. Uh, but don't worry, it's not alcohol. It's an ancient herbal remedy, family recipe. I played the story mode. I watched the trailers. I watched the cutscenes. All right. Guile opens with Sonic Boom, which counters Jamie's drive rush. They're poking each other. That's super unsafe, but you got to punish him with something like Flash Kick, and I don't think he had Charge. The, that that break dance that he does, that's kind of punishing. Carrying those booms. Maybe he probably doesn't want to get burnt out again. Probably sucks. Ice. Ice interrupt on that EX. Ion super present right now. Avoiding everything. He, he goes forward, heavy kick, and he goes Jamie is very fun. He is uh, maybe in the bottom half of the cast. He has some range concerns, but uh, he's definitely viable. He's one of the best rushdown archetypes that there is to offer in the game. As you can see, he's getting in, got him on the corner, goes for a cross up, but EX Flash Kick will beat basically anything. Nice. Throw break. Now Guile is burnt out. Chip him in the corner. Drive impact stun. You can't kill from here. That was probably a little weak combo though. Not not to backseat game here, but you probably want to use your all your drive gauge and your super to do as much damage as possible. Because if Guile comes back from here, that feels bad. Especially now that you're burnt out. Ooh. Just the mania's gotta play this a little safe. Or not. Maybe he's gotta play a little reckless. The Guile doesn't anti-air him. Oh, that reversal. So present with those, he just knows that he's gonna press on those frames. If at any point one of those EX flash kicks is blocked, it's big damage for Jamie, but Scion is very he's using them very intelligently and they're all hitting. That that upside down kick that he's doing, that evades all lows as well. It happened earlier in the last round. Uh, he evaded a Jamie breakdance sweep with it. Jamie doesn't keep his drinks in a round, no he does not. Uh, he would be way too strong if he did. But um It's not that hard to get them. You get them after completing a combo usually. Situations like this, you can also hang back and try to play the fireball war and get a drink after. Get a drink in between balls. Nice. Locks the drive impact. Reacted to it, that would be a dead guile, but it's easier said than done, especially on stream. Nice, perfect parry. Gets the throw punish counter. That's not the biggest damage ever because it's not the same as other punish counter damage, but it's damage. Gets frames and does the drive impact off the special cancel. Ooh. No, that's Manan, that's Manon who uh, keeps her medals in between rounds. That's her gimmick. Carrying booms, hanging back, carrying booms. Full stick a meter for Jamie. Not in danger of getting burnt out anytime soon. But he's not. He doesn't have the life lead, so he does have to make. He does have to take action. He's got to be the active player here. Carrying the jump in, but he's eating another overhead. You can do a free overhead after crouching medium kick and. Not, it's not easy to block. Nice drive rush throw. Big damage because it is because it's getting him out of a parry. Drive impact in the corner. Seals Ladeal. As far as I know, it's one to one. This is semi, so it's not it's not gonna be best of five. The winner's finals that we already saw. 
Converting off of basically everything. Man is looking not necessarily dominant now, but absolutely favorite. Challenging Jamie to get past the loop of wall of booms to bring the speed. Some of them are light, some of them are heavy. He's past it, lost the drive impacts. Gets a dive kick over the boom. It's like, fuck it. All right, just wait. It's a reversal because went for some went for some easy corner pressure. Now they're both low on meter again. This is what keeps happening. They both are challenging each other's meters. So now Jamie's burnt out. Eats guy eats the last of Guile. Makes him block. Now Guile's burnt out. Ooh, goes for the level two super so we can get the flash kick charge. Chips him out. He's trying to chip him out with those. Second set misses though. In burnout, Jamie takes it. Final round, final game. Ooh, double medium punch doesn't get the ender. Double light punch. Gets it there. Light punch. Got counter hit. Medium punch frames. Game's awesome. Nice, jumps out of the throw. Probably was panicking and maybe was trying to do a flash kick, but it's hard to say. Nice. It's here, push him up against the corner. Ooh, stuns him up against the wall. Combo into level three. How much damage is Guile gonna exit this with? He might end up with no bar too. Yeah, he's totally, Ooh, he keeps a sliver. Now Jamie's burnt out because he wants to squeeze out a little extra damage. Hard to say if that's worth it. Ooh. Cornered and burn burnout. It's really hard for it's really hard hard for Guile to get something going. Whips that flash kick. Jamie uh, wins. That looks like a that looks like a mental stack thing. Like that that those matches are going crazy. Cyan's been swinging swinging for so many matches in a row.